business. How's it going? Well, thank God. <laughs> and your mom? She's fine. Okay. Doing very well. Yes. Thank you. Do you refuse to take anything? No. Drink? No, I'm I'm fine. I just ate something before coming. <laughs> oh. Oh. Father! Hi, baby. Bye, princess. Mm -hmm. How are you? Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Young man. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Good. Listen. <sighs> so, Father, that's the man I told you about. He graduated from the university two years ago. He studied business management. And I thought it was wise for him to come to the palace to see you. He doesn't have a job. Young yeah, boy, you're welcome. Thank you. Ooh, well, um, I think he's a fine young man. <laughs> I'm liking him already. Really? Yes. <laughs> Well, it's alright. You're welcome to my palace. And uh, as for the job, of course you know anything for my angel. Yes, so you can give him the job if you so desire. Oh, it's okay. Thank you. <laughs> it's oh it's alright. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for the opportunity. I'm, I'm very grateful. Thank you. It's okay. You've thanked me enough. It's all right. Like, it's still shocking to me. I never knew His Majesty will accept me just like that. Eh? Regarding the, the, the place I come from, the kind of job I do, he just accepted me like that. A lot of people do not even know I'm a graduate. I see. Maybe because you help your grandma yeah, so. because they see me <laughs> they don't even know i, I went but to school you don't have to blame them okay thank you it can you resume work on monday next tomorrow oh my god thank you very it's much okay you're thank welcome. you god bless you thank you amen bless you too god so let me drop you off me so i can go okay How are you? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> yes, ma. Um, so it came. I'll see you on Monday. Bye bye, Just got a job. What? <laughs> what job? The king gave me a job in his company. 
I don't know. He just he just saw me and and, and and and said he likes me and just gave me a job just like that, Mama. Yeah, you are lying. You are lying. Mama, I'm telling you the truth. I'm starting on Monday. Monday, this Monday, Monday, Mama. This Monday. Wait, wait. You are starting a job hmm. at Igwe's company. This Monday. This Monday, Mama. Just like that. Just like that. The job hey, I've been hey. searching for how long? Just like that, too. Oh. Hey. <laughs> It's not one day, it's not one day, it's not one day, it's not one day, it's not one day, it's not one day, let me just go inside and wash my white. Because you're such a thing, you're such a thing, you're such a thing, you're such a thing, go and wash it very well. See that the princess is in love with you. <laughs> Mama, what was the meaning of that? Yes, I can see it in her eyes. You're not seeing anything. No, no, no, it's all over her. <laughs> what I'm saying is all over her. Let me tell you lion begets lion. Yes, the fragrance is always the same, whether rich or poor. Oh, you think because I'm now an old woman, I cannot understand the handwriting on the wall. <laughs> Mama, you know, I don't understand it. Let me tell you, it is always the same. And it is a mystery our people hardly understand. Lion begets. Mama, because there is nothing begetting anything. The princess and I are just friends. And and that's it. <laughs> Nothing like. Kikemefne, <laughs> <laughs> you are a lion. Yes, believe me, you are a lion. Yes, the look remains king of the jungle. You make him look on a No, I don't believe you know? Yes. So, lions always recognize their kinds wherever they are. Oh, I'm making my head swell, though. Why yes, <laughs> no problem. <laughs> but one thing I know for sure, something striking is about to happen between you and the princess. Mama, I'm not no striking anything that is going to happen. We are just friends. Friends. That that's. I see. I'm waiting. My mother those days, when she was alive, she she used to say, "Anya can kwele, Anya can kwele." My angel, what is disturbing you? Father, I had a bad dream. A bad dream? What about? About Nkim. Chidi tried to shoot Nkim right at this palace. Shoot Nkim? Why? Maybe because he felt that we are in love. Or maybe he thought he's the reason I broke up with him. Father, do you know that Chidi had, had tried to sleep with me more than once? What? Even after knowing the implication, yet he still wanted to have his way with me. Father, that is why I have decided to stay far away from him. And to make things more creepy, his friend, his late friend, once told me that Chidi is a rapist. Rapist? Yes. But, I don't know. Perhaps he was just saying that to buy himself through. <sighs> that is a huge accusation from a bosom friend. Dad. You know what they say, your best friend knows your top secret. Hmm. I don't know, it might be a coincidence, but um, I also had a dream. And it wasn't a good one, about it came. Father. Yes. I... I think I'm in love with him, Kim. I know. <laughs> Surprised. 
you are my daughter and um, I know when you are in love. When you are in love with someone, you always like to make the person happy and uh, prosperous. But not to worry. I'm with you on this one. You are? Uh -huh. <laughs> You are the best father in the world, and I love you so much. And you are the best daughter in the whole wide world. <laughs> I love you more, baby. Thank you. <laughs> Our kingdom is in trouble. I think it's better for us to go and pay her a visit. Just a visit. I don't mean going there to discover. Because she's in her kid already. It will be easy for us. Eh? Maybe when she sees us, she will know that we are desperate. Oh, it's been where? Mm -hmm. It's where? Yes. Most times you don't reason like me. Why? You're asking me why. Mm -hmm. Then why are you thinking of paying her a visit? She gave us seven days. Mm -hmm. Didn't you hear her well? I did. And out of the seven days, four days have elapsed. And they are talking of visiting her. Mm. Has her time finished? She gave us a time limit. Mm. And until that time finishes, you have no right to visit her. Do you know that our visiting can cause a distress in whatever she's doing? Don't you know that? This is a spiritual thing. It's not what you see with your naked eyes. We have to allow her until her time elapses. She will be the one to look for us. Tell you talking. Okay. You are on point, eh? No problem. Just concern about you. I beg. No, don't tell me about this. I concern. Are you concerned more than every other person? Everybody here in this kingdom is concerned that we must obey the voice of the gods. Yeah. I'm following you. You should not quarrel over this now. Eh? We didn't do anything. We didn't do anything. You will confess when the time comes. You will confess when the time comes. Oh, yeah, move up. Fast. You are still talking. You are innocent. Okay. Okay, when the time comes, you got to When the time comes, you got to answer. What did he do? What is his crime? Young man, what did you do? I didn't do anything. You are just accusing me wrongly. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. Which kind of dream is this? Why were they beating him? What crime did he commit? Ah, oh, this is not good. Not good at all. Whew. What sign is this dream trying to? Show me. Who is this young man? How come I liked him? Seeing him for the first time. There is something unique about that young man, but I can't place my hands on it. Ah. Daddy? My angel, <laughs> you're back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm fine. I see you're relaxing. Yeah, of course I am. 
Uh, Dad? Yes, my angel. You look worried. What's the matter? Ah, not really. I was just pondering about that young man. Who? He came here for now, of course. Okay. Yes, there is something about him. I mean, there is this aura of royalty around him. He possesses this personality of a king. Hmm. Yes. Well, Father, I think all men are kings in their own way. Hmm. You're right. Well, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. Ah, thank you, Daddy. <laughs> you need to go inside and rest. Okay. You had a long day. Rest well. All right, Dad. And you too. <laughs> Let me take some fresh air. All right, Dad. <laughs> Where are you going with that traffic? I can't help you. The big keep going and I cannot to try. My son is passageway for for grass cutters. So I want to set trap for them to know if I'll catch anyone before night falls. Traps are being set at night and do you know that? Well, this animal is also work around that daytime. I just want to set it quickly. You can please change your mentality. You have to reframe. You know? No? You have gotten a white collar job, which you're about to start tomorrow. Why can't you allow the uh, animals in the bush to rest? Keep not. this trap. Mama, if I catch this meat now, you still be the first to tell me I want the laps. I want this one, I want that. Let me just quickly set it. At least I'm starting work tomorrow. Let me do it for the last time today. I'm going to now. I'm not eating anymore. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. There's, you can make it. You have to, there's no water in the house. I will catch when I come back, Mama. Yay! Eh? Of Ronya, forget it. Hey! I'm not calling for that. Coming to my house this early morning. Morning. morning. morning. Yeah. How are you? I'm fine. Hey. Ah, so, no. Mama. How is His Majesty and the Palace? Oh, everyone is fine and the palace is fine. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, is Ikem around? Oh. I've been trying to reach him and he's not taking my calls. Hey, um, sorry, oh. Um, he left his phone in the room. Yes, he went to set his trap. He will soon be back. His trap? Yes. Didn't he tell you that he's hunting? He used oh. to hunt uh, bush meats. Oh, I see. Oh, yes. Yes, Mama, he told me. He told me. It's okay. Uh, it's fine. Please, when he gets back, tell him to come to the palace that my father wants to talk to him. It's very important. Uh, my princess, is anything the problem? No, no problem. No problem because has your father changed his mind over the job? No, no, no, no, no, Mama. It's not about the job. My father just wants to talk to him. Hmm? Uh -huh. So let him come to the palace when he gets back. It's okay. Mm -hmm.
What is wrong with me? Why am I so cold and bothered? <sighs> Somebody help me, please! Ah, oh, please help me! Help! Oh, help what me! What happened? What happened? Oh. Hey, hey! Somebody help me! Help me! Hey, what are you doing? Hey! Hey! Hey! Hey! Hey! Hey! Hey! No, no! I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, I'm your son! No, i am your son i Will you shut up? Shut your mouth. What's going on? I said 99 days for a thief and one day for the people. Oh he came here. He's a rapist. He oh. him. Raping Chiamaka. Right? Yes. I did not do it. Shut your mouth. Please, please, shut your mouth. Please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, please, I mean, no, say, Chiamaka, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Chiamaka, what are you saying? I mean, no, say, that is not doing it. Hey, shut up. How dare you? How dare you? You left the data of Ono. I did not do it. Yes, I did not do it. I did not do it. I did not do it. I did not do it. You. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, so I could make meal for my father before coming to the palace to, to work. As I was trying to fetch the firewood, someone grabbed me behind. Then I was trying to scream for, for help. He hit me with a strap, threw me to the floor and raped me. It's all over you. Okay. I do not I do not Okay. Quiet, quiet, everyone. God, take him to the palace cell. Who is that? Onye? There's a problem. Which trouble? He came. He came as be arrested. Which, wait, so which he came? My own he came. He came here for now. He has been taken to the palace cell. As we speak now. What did he do? He raped Ono's daughter in the bush. Was oh, man then? Who raped who? He came. Wait, so he came and came. Yeah. Did what? He raped Ono's yeah, daughter. Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, go to an honor. No. Stop the rape. Or some rape. Because one is a no, no. Which he came, he came, came not, cannot be true. Did you touch it? 
can't I can't do it. How can I do such a thing? I didn't do it. They are lying against me. I didn't do it. I just saw Jamaica lying down and blood all over her body. I want to know why. Only for me to come out and start calling me a rapist. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. It is not just a black book. I don't know. I don't know. It's okay. okay. I believe you. I know you did not do it. I believe you. Look. Nothing will happen to you. Okay? Nothing will happen to you. I will make sure of that. Your head will not go for it, okay? Mm -hmm. You have to be strong. You have to trust me. Nothing will happen to you. Please. Can I at least see my grandma? Please. She's in the palace, okay? I'll call her for you. Because you have to be strong. My presence, your time is up. You have to be strong, okay? I'll, I'll try, but I need to see my grandma. Please. Please. I'll call her for you. I'll also get you something to eat. My presence, your time is up, please. I have to go now, don't worry. I'll be back, okay? You have to be strong. <laughs> He can be frank when he's innocent. He can never do such a thing in his life. He can never. Not in this life. Not even in the world to come. He can be frank that can never do this. Woman, keep quiet and stop disturbing us. He came from and raped my daughter. And he must die according to the law. Yes. Hey. Go to the cell and bid him farewell because you may not see him again. Bado, he will be concerned something, please. I'm begging you. Be concerned something. What about what I be? The only thing that is remaining for me. Listen to the cry of a poor widow, be I'm begging you. That is my grandson, the only thing remaining for me. He's innocent. He's innocent. This is just a frame up. I did not bring Ikebe for such manner. Because I'm begging you. Ikebe for the ask fear for women. He has so much respect for women. As you who come down, Gwagi. As you who come down, Gwagi. Ikebe for that one cannot do this. My grandson is innocent. Because he will say something. Do something. Because he came for the has respect for women. Yes. And yet he raped my daughter. Oh. Iwe. My daughter was raped. Even the palace doctor confirmed that. So why are we wasting time with this woman? After all, Ichie Ibuka's son died for the same offense. Why are we wasting time here? Uh, woman, listen to me. We have a law. Yes. We have a law in this kingdom against rape. Therefore, Justice must prevail. But one thing I must guarantee you is that we will do proper investigation. We will carry out due diligence and ensure that we come up with good verdict. A just one. So, go home. Investigate. Madam, go. Go. Go. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy, Daddy, Daddy, Daddy, Daddy, 
But what? Are you going to give him a death sentence? Oh, Father. Dad, he came is innocent. He's innocent. He didn't do it. He didn't do it. Look, my angel. Power belongs to the people. Eh? We, we, we have a law. A decree. No, no, no, no. Don't tell me that. Don't. Don't. That you can't do this to me. You can't. Fine. The people want him dead. But you're king. You have the power to set him free. Dad, you have the power to do this. Please. Please. No. Sweetheart. If, if I do that, they will come against me. <laughs> Look, this is a very delicate issue. <laughs> we have to tread carefully. Please. Dad, no innocent life should be killed under your leadership. No innocent life should. <laughs> <laughs> My father will be back very soon. Very soon. You know, I've missed spreading. Yes, I know, I know, but um <laughs> What's wrong with her? She said she's okay. She's fine. She's fine. Good, good, good, good. Hey. Okay, so. Let King Jabike has a son. Okay. A son? Yes. A son. All the attempts to flush him became abortive. He collided with the chief priest to flush him. But he is a royal blood. Eyes of the gods. We have been standing here for the past 
Five minutes and you have not said a word. Why did you call me out? Wait. Wait. Great. Very well, I will wait. I will wait. Wait. All right, fine, I will wait. I am waiting. Greetings. She's carrying your seed. Wise one. Yes, I Where did you get that information from? I see in the dark. I also see in spirit. And I see the physical. Why do you want to terminate your blood that she's carrying? Why is one I am? Truly sorry about that. Uh, you see, I... I just want to get rid of that which she carries. Please. I need you to help me. Why don't you marry her since you have put her in the family way? Why do you want to destroy the fetus in her womb? No! I something not I cannot possibly marry her. Wise one. I am already betrothed to Ezine. And you know that. I cannot betray my father and marry her. She is just a maiden. A mere maiden. Why is one? You have been my friend for a very long time. I need you to help me get rid of that child that she carry. Hmm. For I have tried so much to get rid of it, but it does not work. If you help me, I promise you, I will take care of your sons. From primary to university education, I will sponsor. Mm. Only if you help me, wise one. Are you sure of what you are saying, my prince? I am Prince Jamike, the heir apparent of the great throne of this great kingdom. I am your next king. I have the power to do and undo. My word is my bond. I'll get back to my shrine, my prince. I'll bring you something. And once I give you that thing, you give it to her. Let her take it. As soon as she takes it, that baby will be gone. But there are consequences she might likely die. That is the least of my problem. It is none of my concern. All I want is for that child to be eliminated. Gone forever. So make sure when you give her the concussion, you send her far, far away from the palace. So that she doesn't die in the palace. Wise one. You sound as if the next king of this great kingdom is stupid. I am not stupid. 
I will send her out. Okay? Quick. Go to your shrine and get me the concussion. Now, don't forget also that there will be consequences. Damn! The consequences, wise one. This is why I have you. Now go. <laughs> Adure. My friend. Sit. My prince, this is the royal blood. Why do you want me to flush your own child? Why? You know why I want you to drink it. Take it. So that my mind can be at peace. My prince, just let me leave the palace. I promise I won't come back. Please, let me just leave the palace with the pregnancy. And the child will grow up and come back one day to reign havoc in my palace. Do not argue with me. No, my prince. No, please. I command you! Drink it! Now! Drink it! Adore, drink it! Royal blood cannot be flushed. I saw everything. Mm. Mm. He is the one that will sit on the throne, that will pacify the spirit. Men will continue to die. Wise one, I beg to crave to crave your indulgence. Please, who is this son of Jamike, our late king? We are talking about. How do we locate him? The Allah Kingdom. Yes, the Allah Kingdom. Ask of Ikemefuna, the grandson of Nedi, the popular Akrasela in that kingdom. That is where your king is. Yes. A soul is weeping. Filled with bitterness. The cloud is gloomy. With chipping sounds of the bed. I see death. Death after death. Sorrow begins. And sorrow refuses to end. I see a woman. Crying for her lovely son. Who will console her and make it not to happen? Go! Go and look for your king. For this needs to be taken care of. If not, all the kings will die one by one. I greet you. Hmm? His Majesty, 
is likely going to change the law. Or free came funa. You may ask me why. Why? Why? Good. Because Princess Adugo is in love with the Kemefuna. Funa. Ah, say, oh, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, possible. no, no, no, it can never be done. Ah, relax. There is tendency that it will happen because His Majesty can do that just to please his daughter. But as the youth of this kingdom, enough is enough, it will never, never happen. happen. Ekene was killed for this singular act. Yes. Mm -hmm. Therefore, Ikeme Funa must equally be killed for this singular act. We will defend it with the last drop of our blood. Ikeme Funa can never go scot free. <laughs> never. Hey, voila, voila, voila. No bodonka. For this village. For this kingdom. You see? He came, must be put to death. Yes. He must be put to death. I don't care about His Majesty or the daughter. I'm not seeing them. I'm not seeing them at all. Uh, that's good. You see, I, I, I like the spirit. You see? This is what we're going to do now. Hmm? I'll be giving you guys money. Handsomely. I'll pay you guys handsomely. Every day. So, night and morning, we will surround and mount guards around the palace and the palace gate. Because I'm having this feeling that His Majesty may want to sneak Ike Mefuna out of the palace in order for him to escape execution. <laughs> so we have to monitor him until the day of execution. Life. <laughs> You're right. Mm. In fact, you are very right. You know what? From this time on, mm? we will hand over the case to you. Mm? In fact, you will rule us. We want to work with you. Mm. Use us. Use us anyhow you want to use us. Eh? Lead us. In fact, lead from now, eh? just rule us. Good. Eh? We'll work with you. Yes. Nice one. You see, I will give you guys a little something. Just go about a drink. Buy some sticks as much as you want to buy. Enjoy yourselves. Go home and um, prepare yourself. Okay? You are the real man. Guys. Guys, guys, guys. Fine. <laughs> wow. All right, so enjoy yourself, okay? God suffer our land. You are the gods that sees both in the physical and in the spirit. You alone knows that my grandson is innocent. He is innocent of the accusation. Please save him for me. Please talk to me. Who is responsible for this pregnancy? Mama, please. I don't want to talk about it. I beg of you. This is the same thing you have been saying since you came back to this house with this pregnancy. Why are you so secretive to your mother? Why are you out of me? Why are you hiding the source of this pregnancy? It is almost time for your delivery. Are you going to hide it forever? I don't understand. And I know you worked uh, uh, uh, in uh, Umwoni Kingdom when you were staying with my late sister. But what I don't know is why you suddenly left uh, the palace at, at where? Mama, and... Mama, I just told you that I was raped by a unknown person. I don't even want to record the event. It's so terrible. I know you are lying. You keep saying it and I keep telling you that I don't believe you. Mama, please. I was raped.
Bu de ya. Ah, oda. Neden? Oku. Hadi, bak ama tepe. Evet. Bir hata olmaz. Hata yapayım. Ya, yapma iş yok. İsyan. Nana Joseph, tomata fofaya. Hadi. Eee. Ha. So how much is it? I'm gonna hundred, hundred naira, two hundred naira. I need the one of one fifty. Ah no, either you buy hundred naira or two hundred. Okay, give me the one of hundred naira. Only hundred naira. Just make I get the one of hundred naira. Okay, na. Customer, customer. Madam. So on a hot car. I just see him. You go like him. No, no, no, no. This your belle. My Jima is good. Ha, hey, man, I like a Jima. For this time, talk here. I go put two jar for you. You mean him? Eh. Ah. See him. Big one. Ah, wow. Hmm. Hey, Jima, you go home. Thank you. Hey, Jima, I will get change you. Please, can you come back for your change, please? I'm just starting for the day. Okay. No, I'll be come back. Okay. Thank you. Enjoy your car. Ah, no, no, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, now. Hey, Nick. Hey, Mama. Mm. Mama, how is the market going? I know. Hey, I'm just trying to save one or two. Hey, Nick. Hey, Mama. Hey, hey, hey, hey. Nick, please sit down. Hey. I want to have a word with you, Mama. What is it? <laughs> Nemo, um, I saw Maziloka as I was coming back. And um, he talked about... Mama, Mama, please, enough. I've told you and this man that I'm not ready to get married to his son. Allow me to put to bed first. Ah, look, that man is a gold digger. All his son wants is for me to give birth to a male child. And if I give birth to a female child, you see him, you just zoom off. So please, stop bothering me with all this marriage, marriage issue. Let me put to bed first. And besides, I'm not ready to get married. How can you be saying that? Eh? How can you open your mouth and say that you don't want to get married? As beautiful as you are. This is abomination. Don't even open your mouth and say it again. Eh? I oh. don't... Hi. Oh, Guinea. Hey. Oh, Guinea. Obia. Mama, Obia. Are you feeling pain? Mama. She ah! Like, she like you. Oh, Obia. Mama. Mama. Hey. Hey. Mama. Mama. Sorry, sorry, sorry, sorry. Mama, I need Why? to go home. No, no, no, not home. Hospital. Mama, I need to go. Hospital, get up. Get up. Ah, Mama. Get up. Sorry. Mama, I need to go. Hey, Mama. Why? Why, Mom? Why? You left this world. Leaving me with your beautiful baby boy. Hey, why did you leave me? Why did you leave your child with me? Why? Why? Hey, the doctor said you took a lot of pill to flush out this baby, which affected your health badly. Why did you even take off it? Why? Why? You forgot that children are blessed from God. 
You forgot that children are blessings to mankind. I... I have forgiven you. I have forgiven you. I will take care of my grandson. I promise you, you will lack nothing. You will lack nothing, my son. I will protect you. I will make you become a mother of your dream. I will train you with all my resources. I name you Ikeme Funa. Ikeme Funa. The strength of your late mother will not be a waste. And my strength, which I will use to bring you up, will not waste either. You will not die when life is most important to you, Wab. <laughs> you will not die premature. <laughs> I bless you. I bless your destiny. I bless everything that concerns you. <laughs> no man. I mean, no man will inherit what is rightfully yours. Else, he will inherit instant death. Yes. Instant death. Because you are a special child. <laughs> Adore. Adore. Adore. Why? Why did you do this to me? <laughs> Save my grandson for me, Bikonu. You are the only one that can do it. Hey, how can I sleep tonight? How can I sleep when he came Efna? My grandson is in the palace cell. Fear and agony staring at me. Why death stares at him? Hey! Uzuma Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Hey! Hey! Hey! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Nebo! Oh, what be a quasa? Oh, what be a quasa? Ah, oh, get it, Captain. What have I done? What have I done? God, so far, our land. I am so helpless. Who will a helpless widow like me run to? Oh, they can get my food. Oh, they can support our wab daughter. Please help me. Help, Ononum. Death has taken all my children away from me. Living only in Kebefna. Kebefna, my last strength. In Kebefna, that's the only thing remaining for me. The only person I can call a human being in my lineage. Now they have accused him of rape. 
Oje kore puru. The bed, the bed, you know my crazy You all know the truth, my gods. You know my crazy uncle, no. He came here and don't do such a thing. He cannot. Hey! They want to hang an innocent child. They want to hang my grandson. Kahakbo chapuze oborum bam bam. They want to clear me off. I'll get it better. I'll get it better. I'll get it better. What have I done? What is my wrong? Oje kambe jorono. Who have I offended? No. I will die before they kill him. But I will just die before they kill him. So grateful. Thank you so much 
uh, Onohu and your co-elders in the palace, uh, we salute you too. Thank you very much. <clears throat> your Majesty, our visit to your kingdom and to your palace is like the mission of an old woman who misplaced her snuff box. All of us know what it means. She will go far and near to make sure she finds it. She will never, never leave anything unturned, including beds, clothes, boxes, everywhere. Your proverbs are always very deep. Huh? <laughs> As a matter of fact, our journey is a very sorrowful one. Your Majesty, it is no longer news that the people of Moni Kingdom have been losing their kings on throne. I mean, losing their kings on the throne immediately after their coronations. Very pathetic, Your Majesty. We will say that we are at the verge of correcting the errors if at all they are not yet corrected. We got an, uh, a woman, a priestess, who revealed to us why the things are happening. That we have been handpicking people and crowning them as our kings. But they are people we thought that the gods of the land have already chosen and approved for crowning. That at the end they will die. So she said that a royal blooded person, son of the soil, must sit on the throne before death will stop because she had she is still seeing a lot of deaths on that throne. Certainly that's the truth, Your Majesty. Eventually she told us that Jamike, our late king, has a son that we never knew. And that his son is here in your kingdom. Yes, Your Majesty. Uh, do we know him? I mean, if I may ask, what is his name? Your Majesty, his name is Ikemefuna. Yes. He is the grandson of uh, Nedi, an old woman that fries Akara here in the kingdom. You lie! You are a blatant liar! No, no, no, you don't call me a liar. Yes, that is what you are. Oh. Your Majesty, so you connived with these people to come here and tell us this nonsense. For your information, the so-called Ikemefuna raped my daughter. What? Yes. He almost raped her to death. But the laws of our land have caught up with him. We are waiting for the next AK day when he will be hanged in this palace. Yes. Your Majesty, you have now confirmed my fears. The villagers and the youths have been saying that your daughter and Ikemefuna are going out. And because of that, you want to exonerate the boy from this crime. When it was the turn of Ekene, you did not waste time to execute him. You stripped his father of his titles. And when he could not contain it anymore and took his life, what did you do? You instructed that his body be thrown into the evil forest. And here you are, trying to exonerate a boy who raped my daughter. You can come from the east, west, north or south. I don't care. It will not stop Ikemifuna's execution come next Ikemaket day. Oh no. Behave yourself. What has come over you? How dare you disrespect our king in the presence of our visitors? Better control your temper 
After all, we all are in this together. Nonsense. I don't have your time now. But your highness, I will not sit down here and continue to listen to this nonsense. Uh, it is very, very unfortunate that at this point we have a very sensitive matter at hand. Ikemefuna, in question, is in our custody. Right in the palace cell, of course. Though he was accused of rape, that he raped and maimed the daughter of Ono, who just left here now. But nevertheless, I want to say, you are welcome. You see, our people used to say, and let me just put it this way, our people say that the gods do not kill anyone who his hands are clean. Of course, Ikemefuna pleaded not guilty of such allegation or accusation. But anyhow, continue what you are saying. I want to believe my king here will have something to tell you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. You, you, your Majesty, please, can I say something? Please go ahead. Go ahead. Um, your Majesty, I know the weight of this accusation. We know what it means and we detest it. Such is a very heinous crime, even in our own kingdom. Um, your Majesty, I want to appeal to you. I would like you to use your wisdom and give justice to this. Thank you very much. We don't do need violence. Let the truth come out real. Well, um, it's all right. Uh, the gods will give us the wisdom to handle this uh, issue. Okay? Uh, you are most welcome to my kingdom. And uh, I can assure you that uh, your safety is guaranteed. What's the meaning of this? Huh? What's the meaning of this rubbish over there? Bring them home. Huh? Such that couple. Bring them down. Are you out of your mind? Huh? I am not out of my mind. I am very sound, as you can see. Now listen, whatever they call you, princess, we are not here to see your face or anyone's face here. Now, get this notice. We are doing our job. We are out to search any car that passes this road. So, be a good citizen, a law-abiding person. Boys, open the boots. Obodo. Oh, Open the boots! Why will you search my car? For what? Princess! Now me the tell for Allah's breakfast too! I'm sure you wouldn't like to have a taste of tea this morning. But start Damoto. Open the boots. Why will you want to search my car? Search my car for what? See something. Are you dead? Open the boots! Fast! Open the boots! I know what you want to do. I know that Chidi put you up to this. Let me tell you something. That Ike Mefuna will get justice. He will get justice. Oh. Yes. That is babash. Babash. And let me let you know this too. Whether Ike Mefuna or Ike Mefuna, <laughs> get justice is not my business. Do you understand? What all we are doing is to make sure this kingdom is safe. Yes. Young man, 
can't you recognize what is on our head and show us some respect? Uh, Master, please come. Officer, allow them to be there. Whatever they want to do, let them do. The princess is here. You mean respect? Respect indeed. What is on your head? You mean the red cap? Boy, open that red cap. Let me see what is on his head. Nothing. Put it back. Now, be calm or I will pull off your clothes and I will see your nakedness. Be calm. Now, get inside the car. Is it clear? Yeah. You search everywhere. It's clear. Yeah, it's clear. Get inside your car. Now, close the door. Oh, yeah? Okay. Fast. You don't want to go? Yes. You're doing a white job. So, go. Be careful. You will hear from me. I will hear nothing. I will hear nothing. I'm hard to do my job. I just want to make sure justice is prevailed in this kingdom. Was the king's son who? Give him to my daughter. No, no, no, no. Never please. It is not rape. They had an affair. Yes, they had an affair. And he drove her away. Oh, Chupia Kokoko. Oh, Kuya? We didn't know what happened, but. I can... knew it. I knew Adure was not telling me the truth. The prince must have threatened to kill her if she speaks out. No. I wasn't I do the where are you? I do the come on, come and fight for your son. The quack alone, man. Your son is innocent. A hey to the throne. He's innocent. Come wherever you are. You are hearing my voice. Come and fight for your son. Let the truth be revealed. Let the truth be revealed. Everything under the sun must come to light. Every hidden secret must come to limelight for everyone to see for themselves. It's okay. Hi. So you mean Ike Mepuna is a royal blood? Yes, yes it is. There's no doubt about that. This is unbelievable. Huh. The cat has been let out of the bag. The truth is out. Let Ono Wu and his group go and hide their faces in shame and keep quiet. Let me still educate you people. The king did not state manage anything. He didn't state manage anything with us. Our people are aware that we are here. And if you people are in doubt of what we are saying, you can go and verify. Please, if people are saying the truth, we are not here to play games or hide anything. If anybody is in doubt, they can go to our kingdom to find out the truth. of money kingdom. I'm in a position to say the truth any time of my life. I can never say lies. Never. So everything we are telling you is true. We can't deceive you. Please. What I've seen is the Lord. The sky is dark. We don't have faith in our evil again. Yes. 
and I will look for a way to see how he can be voted out from that throne. And his princess will leave that palace with immediate effect. Yes. He is not saying a word about Ikim's act. And that silence speaks a volume. I think he wants to strategize and look for how he will either send that boy abroad or declare him innocent. Yes. Oman me. no Buddha. That is an absolute aura. It can never happen. In this kingdom, it is not possible. Oh no. It's not possible. No way. We the youth, we are alerted. As I speak to you, we are mounting guard on the palace gates to make sure he came or anybody will never escape from that palace. I know. And at the same time, our informant inside the palace is giving us the rightful information. Nobody will escape. He came, is still in the palace cell. Obodo, I know all that. But I don't want us to depend solely on uh, uh, an insider. He or she may be compromised. Yes. Hello. That is why we are mounting guards. Roadblocks. And searching every car that comes out of the palace. As a matter of fact, you know, no stone will be left unturned. Gee. Let us talk about removing the eagle from the throne first. That man can outsmart us. You know he's a wise man. Hello. I do not have any interest on the throne. That is set for you, the Ono, and the others to decide. My primary concern is to make sure that Daddy came from of a boy will be executed before the eyes of everyone on the Kemake day. Chidi, you are a true son of your father. Can you imagine that bastard snatching the princess from you? A rapist that wants to be seen walking around with the princess. And they claim he's an heir to their throne. I don't even want to hear that. Because I believe it's a setup by the Iwe. So that he will declare him innocent. A stupid boy that does not even know his father or his background. And they're saying that he's an heir. What stupid heir is that? That is none of my business. AK Market Day is fast approaching. Oh no. In as much as Ekene was killed on this course, posterity must have its due course. Ekene Funa must die just the way Ekene did. That's my own view. I trust you people. I know what you can do. Huh? Look, you don't have to blame her. She was doing it so that she won't be killed. Probably with you in her womb. She wanted to save you and herself. So you don't have to blame her. Okay? Look, your late father was a king. And you are to sit on the throne of Umuani Kingdom. If not you, no one will succeed the throne alive. My both parents are dead. I'm sorry. I know I will die with my innocence. You will not. Okay? You will not. You will not die. I'm already feeling it.
I am in a very precarious situation right now. I am convinced that you are innocent. But the unfortunate thing is that I cannot convince my people about it. Right from the first day I set my eyes on you, I liked you. The situation I find myself right now is that there is a law that I cannot uh, repeal because of the way the law was promulgated. It's actually a decree. And that decree stipulates death penalty by hanging on anyone found guilty of rape in my kingdom. So you see, my hands are tied. I'm sorry. You and I know that Ikim is innocent. He didn't do it. You have to tell the elders everything. Yes, someone did it to her, but definitely not Ikim of all people. Please. I am beginning to feel very terrible right now. Chidi is instigating the youth. He's making sure that Ikim is put to death. All because of the princess is no longer interested in him anymore. He is very happy and will not stop at nothing. Neka, Neka, please. Let's tell the elders and the youth that he came is innocent. Please. 
Oh, Lord, we are not there. Yes, I know. But you and I know that Ikim cannot do such a thing. He's, he's innocent. Change is constant. People can change. Yeah, you're correct. But I strongly believe that Ikim is innocent. Chiyamaka is lying. She has refused to avail to the princess or anyone, all in the name of she's seriously sick. Neka, please. You know Ikim is innocent. His grandmother is sick. She might just die before the execution. Excuse me. Neka! Neka! No, this is not happening. No. Ikim is innocent. Chiamaka is up to something. <laughs> 